my name is Lee Glarmus uh, with Dick's Hot Dog Stand in Wilson, North Carolina, celebrating our 95th anniversary. Goes back a long way to 1921, number one since 21. We are the oldest family owned and run restaurant in North Carolina, to my knowledge, um, as News and Observer reported. You know, we started as a hot dog stand, of course it's still a hot dog stand, but, but the menu has changed right much since 21. Of course, it started with hot dogs, cheeseburgers, hamburgers now. I mean, the hot dogs, obviously, it's the same chili recipe that my grandfather started or created back in 1921, and it's still the same recipe, prepared the same way. And, and then, um, you know, our burgers, fresh ground beef, and uh, we have really good french fries, and then we've added some things, gyros, and we have great omelets, and club sandwiches, deli-type sandwiches, and um, so it's just, I think a lot of people come for different reasons. Some people come for the dogs, others come for newer reasons now, the younger generation. So we try to cover the whole spectrum. You gotta remember, the, the family restaurants are slowly going out simply because in order to have one successful, you got to have the family there at all times. One of them, anyway. And you know, a lot of them passed away, don't have children to leave it to, or either children don't want to get involved. Of course, I've been very fortunate with my oldest boy, Socrates, Dick Socrates Glarmus, that's running it now and uh, doing it. But the secret, like I said, you have to have somebody there that's part of the family to, to run it. I mean, we get people that come back that haven't been here in years that have moved away, and whenever they come to town to visit people, they, they all always stop by, and it's inevitable. They'll walk in. My dad may not have seen him for 30 or 40 years, and he knows exactly who it is or can place a face. Or So he's an interesting man. And it's an interesting location. We've had some great years here. The city of Wilson has really supported us as a business, as a family. And we're grateful to the whole community for being so nice to us for 95 years. Go Mudcats!